never seen this attempted? Sorry. Uh, I've never had it. There have been but a few people to try it. It's probably been how long it takes since the last one's tried. How long? It's four or five years. Yeah, it's been four or five years since anybody's even tried it. How come? Uh, a lot of people, I guess, they don't know about it. It's not advertised. It's not advertised as much anymore as it used to be. So, Like I said, we need someone to beat it so they'll finally make a plaque. Tom, make a plaque for it. This is Pac-Man. We're here at Flying Pie Pizzeria in Portland, and we're here to take on their, their secret challenge. Uh, by secret, I mean they really don't care to publicize it. I am the first one to try this in five years. Uh, I asked them, hey, do you guys have a challenge? Not knowing they did, because it's not publicized on Eat Feats, on foodchallenges.com, or any other website we know of. So he shot back his email and said, yeah, we actually do have a challenge. We don't have to create one. So this is it. This is their supreme combo on a 16-inch pizza pie platter. It features all their meats pretty much. Sausage, salami, pepperoni, and then on top of that, there's all the good veggies. There's peppers and grilled onion, and there is mushrooms. There is one hour to complete it. One hour is free. They've told me it's about seven pounds. So that's a pretty good push for any competitive eater. Um, I'm hoping it's really good so that'll help me get through it. But I am prepared because I, as usual, I fasted going into this, so I'm really hungry. On the drive over, my stomach was giving me all kinds of special rumbles, let me know. Yeah, we didn't even know it was a challenge. Yeah. I just messaged him about doing a challenge. He's like, oh, we actually have one. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, so that'll show you how much advertisement it has. <laughs> Yeah, I don't see it anywhere on a menu. No. Anywhere up on the wall. There's a, actually, there's a sign down in the basement that used to be upstairs. It's the old one. Now it's down in the basement, so... Would you guys want people to attempt it? I wouldn't mind, like, you know, I wouldn't mind I, watching it. Like, from occasion? Yeah. yeah. Time talking about putting a, like I said, getting a plaque and putting it somewhere up here on the wall. And yeah. Getting some shirts made, just to take our normal shirt and then we'll pass that and put it on the Holy, back. that'd be cool. Yes. This is a thick pizza. How many pizzas do you guys make a day? Depends on the day, but today. It's a lot of pizza. This is the one we're known for, though. My jaw is so tired from chewing. This was Pac-Man. We did their uh, the Supreme Combo. 16 inch, seven pound pizza. You won't find this on eatfeast.com. You won't find it on foodchallenge.com. We are the first ones to uh, find this, record it, and deliver it to you guys. Check us out. Facebook, Twitter, biggitislove.com. Thank you guys. Start with uh, lettuce, about, about a pound of lettuce. And then eight scoops of beans, eight scoops of rice, four scoops of meat, four scoops of chunky salsa, sour cream, guacamole, and then we roll everything together, put salsa and cheese on top, melt it all together, and then put sour cream.